Hey guys, Lester, and welcome back to another Pixelmon update video here on the channel. This is currently my second time recording the video, so I apologize if I feel a little, if I feel like I'm a little bit lack of energy right now because my OBS decided to not have my mic connected correctly. So let me just let me just double check real quick. My record, yeah, my mic is there. All right, we're all good. Um, Pixelmon has added another update, and this update has added a bunch of new strike forms into the game. For those who are new to Pixelmon do not know, the other form Pokemon are essentially like shinies and regular Pokemon where you have a random chance of encountering it in the world of Pixelmon. And while shinies do exist in Pixelmon, there's a bunch of other forms as well. And this is just Pixelmon's way of making themselves a bit more unique from the main series games. And that you can still encounter crazy form Pokemon in the world. So... Another thing to note about this update is normally there's always a quote on the page that they sort of say relating to the update. And this update just has a quote that says, waiting dot 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 dot. Now, that could be a hint at the fact that we are still waiting on the new big update of Pixelmon. Because right now their updates are small and they're adding in just a packet of different form Pokemon. But nothing too new to the game. And my theory is that they are planning on updating to the new version of Minecraft very soon. Because for those who don't know, Pixelmon is still in version 1.12. And I'm pretty sure they're going to be updating to either like 1.14, maybe 1.15, 1.16, and for all hopes, 1.18 in the near future. So I think that they're planning a big update, but to tie everyone over, they're doing these small updates as well. So let's hop right into the thing. If you guys have seen me on the channel before, you know how I do things. If you have been enjoying the Pixelmon update videos, consider smashing the like button to show support, subscribing if you're new, and let's hop right into this so for the strike forms the first one we have is eevee i should mention that all these strike forms have the same sort of color style where they're like this dark blue black style with a um sort of like i'm calling it like light blue electricity running through them uh you can describe it as however you will but these are the strike forms now like i said remember all these forms can be encountered in your world in survival you can find them you can raise them you can evolve them and also the note was that they added the strike forms to finish the evolution lines of already existing ones. So some of these strike forms existed before, not the ones I'm showing you right now, but like for the evolution lines and they're just kind of filling the gaps. So next up we have strike form Espeon, looking pretty cool, cool. strike form Gardevoir, strike form Golbat, which is my personal favorite amongst the entire grouping. And also be sure to leave me notes in the comments of what version, what form is your favorite out of these guys. Uh, strike form Curlia looking pretty cool and like I said before so like if you were evolved strike form Curlia into Gardevoir it will now become strike form Gardevoir whereas before it would not do that uh, strike form Leafeon strike form Ralts a very tiny Ralts I should also mention this is as big as the models can get for them like this is their giant gigantic size in Pixelmon so just keep that in mind uh, strike form Sneasel the other one looking slightly different with like a more gray style to the body instead of the black style strike form Umbreon looking menacing Strike form Vaporeon, which literally looks like a skeleton body. Strike form Vulpix. Strike form Yamper with his little cute tongue sticking out. And Strike form Zubat. These are all the brand new Pokemon added into Pixmon. I say brand new in terms of forms, not in terms of Pokemon themselves, because Pixmon has had every Pokemon from Gens 1 through 8 for a while now. This is just them adding all different kinds of forms. And like I said before, these forms are unique to Pixmon only. They are not in the main series games, to my knowledge at least. Um, another note here is they added a new content creator form, a drive. Um, apparently they're doing a thing now with content creators where they are actually, I don't know exactly what it means when they say form, but they are adding in different content creators, possibly for future updates. They're going to be doing something big with that. Who knows? And I also have a note here saying he's back. Um, alter form Kecleon has returned to Pixmon. And when I say returned, I mean in the prior update, he was deleted by accident and his form was gone. So if you, for some reason, or for some unlucky reason, had a alter form Kecleon, he's now gone. Um, hopefully he's come back to you now. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how that works, but yeah. So he's been re-added to the game. Hooray. And that's pretty much it for all the new Pokemon notes. Uh, one more note to keep in mind is that uh, you want to make sure that your Minecraft Forge it's now Forge version 14.23.5.2860 if you are still playing 1.18 ver or, sorry 1.12 version of Pixelmon. I'm saying this in, in case if in the future things have changed. Um, and apparently this was to fix some bugs that were occurring in the mod itself. So uh, make sure you update your Forge to be able to run Pixelmon. Uh, a few other fixes. Uh, more enchantability changes to Pixelmon items. And there's a list of items there. Uh, fix Burmy always appearing as the Trash Cloak. Uh, Misty Explosion is now a special rather than a physical move. Um, Pokeballs no longer attempt to capture every Pokemon in its path. Trader editors will now properly update the NPC when using the randomized slash switch, switch 
buttons. Fixed Pokemon with Pokegifts being all considered the same Pokemon. And remove the ability to give a Pokemon max moves via slash teach. And there's a bunch of battle fixes as well as some developer notes as well. You guys can read for yourselves. I will link in the description down below the download, which will also have the, the catalog as well, which displays all the notes I'm reading. Uh, and you guys can check it out for yourselves. But that is pretty much it for this Pixelmon update 8.3.5. Um, let me know in the comments once more what your favorite form of Pokemon that I went over today has been added. And uh, I'm really excited to play some more Pixelmon. I still do have to finish off my Pixelmon Survival Series. There's still like, I think, five episodes left that I haven't recorded. Um, I do plan on still finishing it, hopefully before Pixelmon fully updates. Um, if I do not, if Pixelmon does a full update into a new version, I'm just going to probably start a new series. Just keep that in mind right now if you're one of my fans still patiently, very patiently waiting for that series to continue. Uh, I just haven't had time to do it, so it is what it is. But that being said, that is going to do it for the showcase. If you guys did enjoy, consider smash the like button, share support, subscribing if you're new. And I hope you all have a great day. Stay safe. Have a happy holiday. Goodbye.